Hi, today's question is uh, what is allele? And we have four answers. You may choose any of these answers and then compare with my explanation. You may stop video here, choose on your own and then compare. So uh, here's my explanation. Uh, let's start from the answer A. Another word for a gene and I would say that this is close. Let's see at the other question, uh, other answers. Homozygous genotype and uh, answer C, heterozygous genotype. So let me explain these two answers. What does it mean? For example, we have uh, one plant um, dominant for some trait, for example, for the color of the plant. Let it be red color and another plant uh, would be um, homozygous recessive for the uh, also for this uh, trait for the color but it's going to be white so this is recessive and this is dominant and if we cross these two plants we will get a progeny so we can call this plant uh, parent 1 and this one parent 2 and the progeny would be F1 generation so we would have uh, this parent would provide one dominant um, gene for this trait and another one provide one recessive gene for this trait and we will have here a uh, uh, heterozygous plant that going to be the same phenotype phenotypically the same like a parent uh, that is uh, dominant because it has one dominant gene and another gene is uh, recessive so we call it a uh, phenotype we have two different genotypes but the same phenotype and uh, we also have one genotype recessive here one dominant here and one heterozygous so we have uh, homozygous recessive, dominant uh, homozygous and heterozygous. So we can uh, also cross out uh, these two answers because uh, this is not correct answers and the correct answer is D, one of the several possible forms of the gene. So we can also cross out answer A. So we see uh, one gene have uh, two different forms, like here it's recessive and uh, this gene codes for the white color and the same gene in another plant, another parent code for the different color that is dominant, but uh, it's not about dominance and recessiveness, it's also could, could be codominant, for example, in this case we would have uh, a plant for example that would be phenotypically different from the both parents like uh, for example this is red color uh, plant and this is white color plant they may produce uh, say pink plant if it would be codominant so there can be uh, many different uh, possible forms of the gene not just two dominant and recessive but many other forms and uh, some of the uh, forms can be say for example A can be dominant over say A1 but A1 can be dominant over the A2 and A2 can be dominant over the A3. So um, 
there are many different possibilities and uh, two alleles usually use it in uh, different examples but as I show here uh, it can be two, three, four and many many other different forms and usually um, allele that is present in less than uh, 1% is called uh, mutant and all uh, alleles that is present uh, in more than 1% is just different forms of the gene but all of them uh, considered to be uh, uh, wild type not mutant though some of them can be uh, dominant and recessive to each other thank you for attention that's all for today goodbye and please subscribe to my videos that I post every week